Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is your speaking and welcome to another game. This time it's going to be a 3 versus 3 teamer played on skirmish planes map without city states, without <laughs> without ruins, without barbarians. Uh, League style, which means no Great Wall basically, and no plus 4 fate from Wonders, Pantheon, and I believe no plus 100 gold mm, founder religion. Uh, my team is Xaris, Dedical, and, and me, and we are playing mirror teams, so I got Rome. On the opposing team, Hitman has Rome. Kivle Beef has Iroquois. Uh, Dedical has Iroquois. And Xaris has Russia, on the other team Pimderx has Russia, yeah, yeah, gold looks cool. Mm, no, no team speak. Mm, okay, and what do we have? At least not me. At least not me. Uh, okay, so... Let's look at Daddy Cole. Well, basically, all of those players are very, very strong players. Uh, so this is looking quite, quite as an interesting game. Okay, let's check out what do we have in the front lines. I do want to go... Oh, sold. Nice one. I actually do want to stay in here. I know there's a couple of hills. We will make uh, a lot of great tiles, but um, I don't want to lose the chop. And I don't want to lose the chops, and I actually want those three hills to be in my borders right away. So I'm definitely going to plant where I am. Mm, and usual stuff, well, I'm in front, which means, well, teamer wise, the usual stuff is basically like monument, uh, monument, scout, liberty, and all the good stuff. Basically, this is how this goes. Russia went for, ah, oh, look at his capital, amazing capital for Xaris. And Daddy Cool, Daddy Look Cool could go. Daddy, you could go on the hill uh, north of Warrior. We'll get three wheat, marble, Isens. Yeah, he should go to this hill. He will get three wheat, wheat later on. He will get marble and he get ice in his, his capital. I know it's going to be quite far in the back, but that sounds reasonable. But I guess Daddy Cole is is well. Good luck, have fun. The plan. Plan is simple. Echo up. Take it easy, no risk, and kill with echo advantage. Yeah, go on that hill. Yeah. With cap daddy. Yeah, exactly, there we go. It's a very, very nice capital. Okay, let's go to the front line. One, two, three, well, it's not... Ha, ah, another salt. Excellent. Excellent, I like the idea. Let's check this out. St. Petersburg, not that much great land in front. Uh, I'm sorry if I will not be able to... If I will miss a couple of parts of commentary. I'm like, those teamers and duels with... The sportsmen like sports like mm, games are very very uh, I'm like I need a lot of focus on them and actually being the captain of the team so that means even more focus one two three perfect I like the city spot uh, well, not that great but not that bad either we've got a silk a desert that I can actually use and a lot of other good stuff Okay, Rome. I do love Rome. Uh, Daddy, maybe you can send her to front and scout back later. <laughs> okay, doesn't matter that much. 
Well, basically all of them are very good players, so this is going to be a very interesting game. The only thing that I don't like... Oh, nice one. Grand Mesa. The only thing that I don't like about this is that I'm in front. I don't like to be in front that much. And I do need a scout, and after a scout I need a granary. Now, Rome is a pretty interesting... Rome is a pretty interesting civilization. I like Rome very, very much. Uh, it's a cool civilization, uh, making you... I mean, like, it's an echo civ that can be very strong in Asian era on offense and on defense. But basically what makes them so cool is the 25% boost in production in other cities uh, towards buildings they already have in your capital. I say that's amazing, okay? It's just amazing. Okay, let's just be certain. So usual bounce, usual bounce, right? No plus for fame and no plus 100 gold. Or did we add something new? <laughs> okay, well, there is something new, which is Iron Fate. Iron... Uh, iron Salt Fate. And that's a pretty strong Pantheon. So... Ah! Pimderk's Russian Declare War. Mm, you run away, damn it. Okay, that, I, I was too slow. <laughs> A little bit too slow, okay, and then the granary, and next spot, of course, usual stuff is animal husbandry, go. Animal husbandry, go, go, go. Okie doke. Team, team Xaris, come on. <laughs> yeah, team. <laughs> well, basically everyone goes uh, pottery and then... Animal, ha animal, ha animal husbandry, so that's not that such a big deal. I definitely want to plant Grand Mesa, and I think I want to plant behind the Grand Mesa. Yeah, it's going to make me a nice defensive spot with three weeds, a natural wonder, and two salts. It's going to make a very cool city. And by the way, I really want to go in here. Go. You proposed. Why do you take my gold? Ah, oh, you're going to buy the weed. Fine. By the week and grow, 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 grow like crazy, man. Mm, where's that warrior going? Ah, there we go. Surround warrior. Watch out for that warrior. Yeah, watch out for that warrior. Now, the question is do I really want to rush a settler? No, I don't. I don't like to rush settler before a liberty settler. I don't think there's a need. I will just go front and scout with my warrior. Probably get an archer to get rid of this warrior and scout this side. But I will definitely want to take this slowly. Okay, liberty, since I'm in front. When you're the front player... Um, okay. When you're the front player, most of the time... Uh, well, basically in teamers and duels, most of the times you want to get um, you want to get to liberty and get settlers and get fast cities as quickly as possible. Uh, just because most of those games is heavy in production focus and liberty just excels at production focus. So, well, basically you will see how this looks. I did not make a three v three. Mm, video for a long long time uh, so hopefully I can catch up a little bit I America could make religion everyone can make religion well remember we have new pantheon earth mother I could pick it as well now all the dirty all the dirty yeah, all liberty, go, go. You need to get to the front. You need to get to the front. And everyone to fight. I basically, I want everyone to fight because um, all of them are very, very strong fighters. And fighting 2v1 uh, or even 1v3 
I mean like 1v2, 1v3 is amazingly hard so basically what you want to do, I what I want to do is I want to make all the players go to the front mm, so everybody everybody has a piece of uh, of fight that they do that they can focus on and basically in my opinion that's crucial for a successful game oh look how close he is he's pretty close, Pim is close in here, okay, Pim is close that makes a very very successful game if you can really get there to the front line with every single player and it's pretty cool marble and he well he's got a full he's got a very nice couple he didn't miss a single horse he's got two horses a very nice couple you guys have crazy capitals really great capitals all right we need to get to the iron asap because we've got russia mm. What? Two warriors. He made two warriors? Oh my goodness. Hmm. Ah, he got... Okay, he got two warriors. Right, let's go. Let's cut his capital. Bronze working and then archery. Bronze, archery, archery. Bronze first, <laughs> extra hammers, go. Okay, Liberty, go. And soon I'll get the extra food, and then we could use. Well, I could definitely use another. Ah, oh, yeah, I could use a shrine. I forgot about that. Ah, and of course, I messed this up. Alright, he's on population 2. Which is most probably he's going to go for an early city in here. I could probably use a war... Ah, let him get it. I'm just gonna fortify him here. Fine. Uh, I think... I think it is Russian settler. Oh, not. Oh, not. <laughs> oh, not. <laughs> Pantheon founded Ed Mother. No. Actually, it's not an Ed Mother. That's good. Right, production focus, shrine, bronze working, and after bronze working, we need archery so I can secure my frontal land, front land. Mm, okay, let's go. I need to send a scout, and I need to back up my warrior sooner or later. Like, I'm not that afraid. I don't think he's gonna move too much forward. I guess he's gonna get copper. Uh, you get something and kill him. Kill. Yeah, move forward, go, go. Ah! He's getting in here alright. <laughs> he's getting in here. I really want to check out the south. Probably want to get a scout. Yeah, I want to get the scout. Go. I don't want to get to this city as fast as possible. And I do want to have a worker. Uh, yeah, eight turns. I could really use a worker and improve the assault. I only got one lux in my capital though. And I see only two luxuries, that's not that great. Well, let's check what's going on in here. Yeah, there you go. Kiv the Beef's Arco Warrior. So I know if he actually did back up this warrior or what was that? Move. Ah, damn it, too slow. <laughs> ah, too, too slow. Okay, Iron. Yeah, I got Citrus, so this makes for a next city in here. Probably even further away, like something in here. Now, daddy, go front. I'll leave the north and the back. Leave this. Okay. Well, this guy is not in a good shape. We'll have to stay in here. Okay, can we please move away? Thank you. Not the best choice in here. I could probably use a worker and an archer later on. Okay, iron here. And iron here. Yeah, this is going to be a perfect spot. Mm, not so sure about this one. But I kind of like this as well. So probably I'm going to make a front stand in here. It's 
has nice food and like those frontal cities in here. I pr I bet he will go in here because this is the style of of uh, Fred. This is Fred's style, basically of combat. Uh, he likes to plant frontal city, frontal defensive cities. Uh, well, that's kind of cool. But I'm not a huge fan of this, just because there's not going to be much food in there. Okay, I do want to have an archer though. Archer and a walker. Go, go, go. First, grow just a tiny bit more. Yeah, five turns, and then I will go for settlers. Uh, okay, next, yeah, we need calendar, that's for sure. That's for sure. There is a warrior roaming around in here. Ah, he's already got two workers. Hmm, interesting. I probably should have made this with a shift click, but that's fine. Okay, move south. Add mother. Oh, desert folklore. The question is, will I be able to get add mother? It's going to yield me one, two, three, four, five, probably six fate. Well, depending where I will plant this city, though, am I going to go for silk or or somewhere else? And in the back is the nice spots as well. There's spots for one, two. Yeah, one, two cities in here. One and two cities actually in here. Very nice land, especially nice couple in here. Okay, let's check out what's exactly in here, and can I actually move my scout? Mm, risky, risky. Yeah, but let's try to deal something. Move there. Okay, go. Are they still trying to catch up that warrior? It's only one warrior, come on, be serious. <laughs> The only problem is if he's going to get in here and I'm going to get the free settler, uh, it would be a disaster if we actually managed to snatch him out of, <laughs> snatch him from me. I'm like, they messed this up. The settler actually spawns in on this tile. It's absolutely not good. Oh, marble, nice. Okay, hello there. Oh, wow. Let's just check. No, no, no. Let's check. Diplomacy overview, liberty, liberty, yeah, everybody wants liberty, fine. That was to be expected. What I would actually want is two workers. Yeah, I would love to get two workers before I will start making settlers. Perhaps I will be able to grow to population 6. That will be amazingly good. Get two workers, get a caravan, and a lot of good stuff. Okay, move back, move south. Mm, okay, the next stop we could probably use is trapping. Ah, uh, hello there, Hitman, Roman warrior. <laughs> Hi. Hi, how are you, basically? Hmm. But this spot looks nice. I definitely want to sit in here. It's gonna get this weed, two salts later on, uh, and a spot in here. Basically, later on, I could plant a city in here as well. Can I survive this? No! My sieve just minimized. Damn it. Okay, fortify. Ah, too slow. <sighs> so slow. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was so slow. Okay, nine turns and a caravan. You cannot. Yeah, 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 I know that. Okay, go settler. Go settler, go. Ah, this guy will die most probably.
Well, I feel <laughs> there's so many. Uh, there's two warriors in here, actually. Don't like it. This guy needs to survive, though. Will you survive? He's gonna heal up now and gonna hit me again, right? No, oh, actually not. Two warrior workers in here. Hmm, my sandwich. Ah, yes, trying to get this guy out. <laughs> goody, goody, goody. Well, reaching population, yeah, probably not the best idea. But I do want that to happen. And especially I want a circus, because this is Rome. I mean, like, Rome is crazy strong if you're able to get... Mm, if you're able to get a lot of buildings in your capital, then it's crazy strong. I just need to protect this scout. I don't like shift clicks. Uh, I'm just because I played so many NQ games. Uh, I'm a little bit out of practice with shift clicks. Probably someone minimized again. Mm, this is just going to be loading screen. Some quick moves in here. Right or not right? Probably yes. <clears throat> well, something definitely not working well at the moment. I wonder what. Shift enter won't help. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this is the bad part about civilization. It still is quite buggy and like somebody just disconnects or something like that. That's not like that's not cool. Xaris, are you here? Xaris, Mr. Xaris. Okay, let's reload. So um Thank you very much for watching and see you after the reload. Best wishes, here is out.